Scotland won Ukraine 3 and this match began with an emotional rendition of the Ukrainian national anthem and ended with a group of players celebrating a performance that typified the spirit of their nation in the war against Russia. Make no mistake, the Ukrainians deserved their win. They were technically better and could have been 3 nothing up inside the first half hour, but for the heroics of Scotland goalkeeper Craig Gordon, who produced one top save after another. Ukraine were playing with a freedom on the pitch to match the efforts of their countrymen fighting for freedom at home. They were rewarded just beyond the half hour when Andrei Yarmolenko managed to stay on side to coolly chip the ball over the onrushing Gordon. Steve Clark brought on Ryan Christie at the start of the second half, but Ukraine doubled their advantage when Roman Yeremchuk headed home four minutes after the break. Scotland eventually started to threaten the Ukraine goal. John McGinn missed an absolute sitter before Callum McGregor scored 11 minutes from time to lift this Hamden crowd. As Scotland pressed for the equaliser, they left themselves wide open to that breakaway and Artem Dovbik raced away to score Ukraine's third to seal their playoff final place against Wales for a place at the World Cup finals in Qatar. It finished here at Hamden Park. Scotland won, Ukraine three. And at the end of the game, no argument about the result from the Scotland manager, Steve Clark. It's what, it's what we expected. I knew they'd be well prepared and they were well prepared. They're a good team. We didn't pass the ball well enough in the first half. And that's also a credit to Ukraine, the way they pressed us. They got on top of my two ball-playing midfield players and we couldn't, we couldn't really get out. Uh, I decided to make a change at half-time to try and address that and get another midfield player on the pitch and try and play through the lines. And before we have a chance to play with that system in the second half, we're two goals down. And from there, it was a long way back. One little footnote here inside Hamden Park, the Ukrainian manager Alexander Petrikov paid tribute to the Scottish people for their warmth and affection towards him and his players and said the victory was for the Ukrainian people, for those soldiers fighting in the trenches, for the people in the hospital, for everyone fighting for the freedom of Ukraine. This victory tonight was one step, the next one is against Wales at the weekend for the right to get to the World Cup.